Hi everyone, this is Boris, developer of VGC. Um, recently, I've been asked uh, what was the Mobius Cut option in vPaint. Like if you go to View, Advanced, and Advanced Settings, you can find here there is this uh, Mobius Cut option. So first to explain what is that for, let's draw what I call a Mobius Trap. So the first thing you do, you disable intersections in the sketch tool, and you're going to draw a loop like so. Once you have this loop, you just go using the paint bucket tool and we'll use a different color. And we'll click here to fill this area with the selected color. So this, this shape is what I call a Mobius strip. So, so why do I call this a Mobius strip? It's because as you can see here, this intersection is actually not tracked by vPaint. And this way, this means that topologically, this actually looks like the 2D projection of a Mobius strip. So what's wrong with uh, this shape? So if you go to sketch mode again and select a black color and enable intersections again and try to cut this shape here like so, you can see there's a strange thing happening. There is this area which is now filled with the color. Um, and actually, if you want to understand why, or rather what this shape is now, you can select everything and use this explode tool. And once you explode the shape, you can see that vPaint created those two shapes, which obviously doesn't look like what we want. So if you go back, let's just undo uh, these operations. Once more, all right, so this is the shape. So first to understand why it did that, we can try just to draw a simple disk. So if you go to the sketch tool again, and we draw a disk, and then with the paint tool, we're gonna fill this area like before, and go back to the sketch tool, the black color, and cut this shape. So as you can see, normally when you cut a disc, you get two halves, right? And so if you explode this shape, you can see we have two half discs. And this is basically exactly the same that what happened with this shape when we've cut it. If we go to the pen tool and you cut this shape and then you select everything and explode this guy, you can see you have two shapes, so it's exactly the same. But it seems quite obvious that this is not the result that we would like if we cut this mobile strip here. But because the paint right now is not like smart enough to determine the correct thing to do, you have to explicitly tell the paint that this shape is a mobile strip before attempting to cut it. So now that I've selected the Mobius Cut option here, if I select the sketch tool and try to cut this shape, now it's doing the right thing. So you can see there is only one face now. And if I select everything and do explode, you can see now that this is exactly what was expected by the users. So this is what Mobius Cut is. So basically, if you have a shape which looks like a Mobius strip and you need to cut it, then you have to explicitly check that box before doing the cut. And if you want to do uh, like a traditional cut instead, then you have to go back to unchecking this thing. So now you might wonder what this reverse cut is as well. It used to, to be used before in a previous version of the paint. Uh, but now vPaint is smart enough that you actually don't have to check that box. So it's, uh, it's useless for now. You can just um, ignore that there is this checkbox. So this is it. That was the explanation for this Mobscap feature. Uh, thanks for watching and see you next time.